Daddy Dane. And Dane. Daddy Dane. And Dane. And today we're talking about something that is very special to me. This here inside these boxes is something that I have been saving for close to 40 years. It is my baseball card collection. So I started this collection in the 70s and early 80s and I have been holding on to this box or I should say these boxes until I can have time to really show them to somebody that's very special. So who's that special person? Mm -hmm. It's little Dane. It's, it's Dane here. So we're going to go and show you kind of a little bit about what's in the boxes and we'll probably go through one of the teams and look at some of the cards. And this is dad's baseball card collection. There's probably close to I don't know, five to 10,000 baseball cards in here. So let's get started. Okay. All right. What box? So the first box. Yes. Is this box. Yes. So Not everything, sure. everything is. Double. Everything is by team. So there is like the Reds and there is the Royals, the Red Sox. It goes on and on. I put spacers in here with, um, with newspaper. This newspaper goes back to like a long time ago. Well, the White Sox, the uh, Yankees, there's a section for doubles. doubles. And then there's two more boxes. Let's see in the other boxes, okay? Yes. All right. The second box. This is the second box. So in here we have the Giants and the Mets, the Padres. There is the, oh, what's that one, Dane? Nope, that's the Phillies. So that one must be the what? Pirates. Oh, the Pirates. We'll get back to that one in a little bit, all right? Let's look at the other box, okay? Okay, Dane, third box. Yep. Astros. Angels. The Angels, the A's, the Braves. Who's that? Brown. The Brewers. And the Cardinals. Oh, wow. Cardinals. You know, we got, we got a helper now, too. So Anna's coming well, up here to help us, too. And we're going to go through the Pirates now. Cubs. Okay, and the Cubs. All right, let's go through the Pirates, all right? Um, all right, Dan, I want you to take out the entire Pirate collection. Okay. So it's right there. And it goes all the way down through here, too. So, Anna, you can take this set right here, okay? So take out that, take that, that whole group. Okay. And let's set them out and let's see what we got, okay? I can't get it. You can it's get it. it's, it's too much. Take a little bit at a time like this. Oh, yes, I see. They're in no particular order. There's all Pittsburgh Pirates from the late it, 70s, early 80s. Oh. Okay, bring that over here. Let's get the oh oh okay. So start looking through them and tell them who you find, okay? Um, shouldn't we like? Yeah, let's just move these. Let's back these. We have a pirate card. I got all of these by going to um, the store. The store they used to sell them in little packs called Tops or Fleer or Donneris, and they'd be like ten or fifteen baseball cards in a little pack and a piece of chewing gum. So you used to always have chewing gum with the baseball cards. How much were they? I don't remember, a couple dollars. But then I got to the point where um, I just wanted to order by sets. So I ordered like full sets for each year. They got like a full set of Donneris, full set of Fleer, Tops. Yeah. And nowadays they don't even make um, some of those co uh, companies don't even make those. Okay. So let's see what we got here, Dane. So if you look at them, you can see like there's different styles of cards. So these would be, oh. I believe these are the Donneris cards. So these yeah. are guys like, so that's Chuck Tanner. Show her, show her, show her that. That's Chuck Tanner. That was the man, the manager of the baseball team back then. So this is Lee, uh, Lee Mazeroski, Larry Williams. Who's this? Tony Pena. Tony. So this is Tony Pena. He was one of the um, catchers, and he had a really interesting style. He used to always have his one leg out, one leg under when he was playing catcher. Jim Wynn. Jim Wynn. I don't know if I remember much about him. So some of my favorite baseball players on the Pirates was like um, Bill Madlock, Willie Stargell. There's another Tony Pena here. Another Tony Pena. Uh, Jason Thompson, he was one of my favorites. Johnny Ray, Johnny Ray was one of my favorites. So what are the years? Tell me what the years are right here. Read the years. 1981, 1982, 1983, 1984. Okay, I was 11, 12, 13, and 14 years old when these cards were printed. So, so you got was, them when you were 11, 12, 13, 14? Mm -hmm. So that was probably 14 when those cards came out. Who's that? 
We might have lost it. Dad, I think you had them organized by pack. I, I probably did, but it's okay now. I mean, they've been in a box for 40 years, so okay. we can unpack them. I'll bit. show them the cards. I can... There he is. Bill Madlock, his third baseman. Yep, that's Rick him. Rodin. I remember when I met him one time. It was pretty cool. Eddie Solomon. I'm Rick Roden? Let me see Rick Roden. Where? Yeah. Lee Rick Roden. Show Lee Lacey, Anna. Chuck Tanner. Oh, another Chuck Tanner. Lee Lacey? Lee Lacey. Who's this one? Kurt Bavaca. I don't know this guy. I don't remember this guy. Kurt Bavaca. Dale Vera. Oh, where's Dale Vera? Mm -hmm. Dale Vera. He was a shortstop. Rod Scurry. Dale Vera. Tim Foley. Yep. Rick Holden. Grant oh, Jackson. Man, look at this. What do you guys think about this? Is this pretty neat? Yeah, it's mm -hmm. cool. There he is. He was my favorite. Jason Thompson. He was the first mm -hmm. baseman for the Pirates. This is Jason Enric Thompson. Enric Romo. Jim Rooker. Yeah, Daddy. this is back when the Pirates were winning baseball games. They made the Look, playoffs. that's a team. Because it's, yeah, here's a full team. What year is it, Anna? I don't know. What year does that say? Where? Does it say what year it is? What about in the back? I don't see it. No year. I don't know. It was, you know what year it was? It was a long time ago. Stars. I was like a lot younger. Denny? Denny? Who's that? Denny Lee Gonzalez? Lee 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 don't remember Lee. him. Kent Tavoli. Kent Tacovi where? Oh, uh, Teak. Kent Tacovi? There he is Kent right there. Foley. Listen to this by him. Kent, Kent Tacovi, Dane, had a throwing style. It came sidearm. So instead of throwing over the head like this from like the ear to there, he had a sidearm throw. Jim Bibby. Jim Bibby, yeah. Bill Robinson. Tony Pena again, yeah. Larry. Larry. Cecilia Conti. Larry. Tony Pena. Rick Larry Gordon. Larry McWilliams. Manny Sanguian. Look at this guy. Manny Sanguian. Rick Roden. Where's Rick Roden? Rick Roden. Danny Gonzalez. Oh, yeah. Pat Clement. These are the cards we show them, right? No, I don't know if he shows it or not. So these are, these are tops. So these What's are like... You're right, Anna. They're, they're, they were in um, the order, like, Flea or Donneris Tops. I had them in, like, a specific order. And, we and just ruined it. In different years. Oh! oh! This! We just ruined it, Dad. The statue downtown mm -hmm. that I walked you by one time, and I said, there's Willie Stargell. Well, here is Willie Stargell. Dad, we just, like, ruined it. doesn't matter. Your here is statue. Willie Stargell. Guess what? Yeah, I have two Willie Stargell baseball cards. Mike Brown. Yeah. So what years were they? Um, let's make Mike a pile Brown. of cards we already did. Oh, Don 1962, Robinson. 1963, 1964, 1965, 1966, 1967, 1968. There's another Rick Rowan. The Cobra. Dave Parker. 1974. Yeah. 1975. 1976, Denny Gonzalez, Larry McWilliams, 1979, 1980, 1981. 1981. So this is when I was 11 years old. Willie Stargell played for the Pirates. My grandmother liked him too. That would make a pile of cards we did. That looks like the pile of the cards we did. Yep. Um, what show? Rod Scurry, another Jason Thompson. Thank you for showing me that. You're welcome. Another. Jason Thompson. Tony Pena, Tim Foley. These might be worth some money, Dan, but I don't know if they're worth much money. Like, there's another Bill Madlock card. Yeah, pretty awesome. I used to love collecting baseball cards. Not kids collect, like, Pokemon cards and other things, but I used to collect baseball cards. Um, and I collected a lot of baseball cards, huh, Dan? Mm -hmm. You want, to, you want to count how many we have? How many pirate cards we have? That would be, that would take too long. I don't know. I'm going to do it. You ready? You count it. Okay, one, four, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight, twenty. All right, Dan, so we counted the pirates. How many pirate cards did Daddy collect? One hundred, two hundred, three hundred. 200, 300, 400, 450, 
451. So it's close to 450 pirate baseball cards. Okay. And that came out of that little corner right here. Right here. So if you add that up, there's a lot of baseball cards okay. here. So if that's almost 500 baseball cards, that would be um, each team. I have to do the math, but that's a lot of baseball cards, huh? What do you think about this? Good. Now, should I should I sell all these cards or should I give them to you? Me. You think you would want all these baseball cards? Yeah. It yeah. isn't too much. Huh? It isn't too much. It isn't too much? Hey, Daddy Dane. Andy. And so Dane and I just went through my baseball collection. We're really only getting started. Got a lot more to go, but we started with the Pirates. We're still going to yeah. look at all the Pirate team here. We finished up with um, kind of a lot of baseball cards. Here is the pirate team. I have to see what year this is. I'm not sure. It's probably 1981-82. Yeah. What? Next time, let's look at the Cardinals. The Cardinals. All right. Well, so this is Daddy Dan. And Dane. And um, we're going to keep going through these baseball cards. But this is stuff that I've been waiting a long time to do. And I'm so excited we got to do it with my son, Dane. Right? Right. Until next time. See ya.